Let's compare metabolic acidosis versus alkalosis. So the first thing you want to look at, what's the pH doing? Think of it as pH is driving the bus. Anytime pH is over 7.45, whether it's respiratory or metabolic, then you're in alkalosis. If your pH is under 7.35, then you're in acidosis. So with metabolic acidosis, you typically see diarrhea because remember, it's coming out of the butt. AKA your acidosis. So with our metabolic alkalosis, like if someone's vomiting, so you have your stomach acid. If you're losing your stomach acid, then you're going to be losing the acid, putting you in the opposite alkalosis. So a memory trick, I like to think of an alcoholic might vomit. So vomiting, also NG tube suctioning, because that's pulling that stomach acid out. Think alkalosis, the K is low. So we're also low potassium for our alkalosis. If we're in metabolic alkalosis, who's going to come to save us is going to be the lungs. So compensation, we're going to see slow, shallow respirations. 